はい、いつゆか。Well, I took you to the real Ryokan, seen you in the previous video. Did you watch it? If not, click here and watch it. I think you can get some idea how the onsen ryokan is. Well, I want to explain one thing. Well, if the ryokan has onsen buses, we usually call them onsen ryokans. And of course, there are many ryokans which don't have onsen buses. We call them just a ryokan. Okay then, in this video, I will share more about what I did in Nagano. Well, I had a great time at the night and I had really nice sleep in a really nice room, as you can see. And in the morning, I had a breakfast at the same restaurant where I had a dinner. And this time, they served my breakfast in the traditional tatami floor room. We call it washitsu. You might be surprised though, most of the ryokan serve many dishes for the breakfast too. We have sashimi <laughs> for breakfast. <laughs> it's um, kind of typical of the ryokan. And this one uh, grilled fish and some seaweed uh, and then fermented beans, natto, a bowl of rice, and miso soup, and salad for sure. You need to eat vegetables, right? And this is not a white wine or any alcohol um, beverages. This is uh, apple juice. Uh, actually, this area is um, uh, apple is kind of famous, so uh, we call it Shinshu Ringo. So I recommend you to take onsen bath before breakfast. It's just uh, refreshing and it make you a little bit more hungry. After the breakfast, I checked out Shinyu and I joined tour Shinyu Offers, which is the tour of Suwa Grand Shrine. The Suwa Grand Shrine is comprised of four shrines Kamisha Honmiya, located in Kamisuwa, Kamisha Maemiya, located in Chino, and Shimosha Akimiya and Shimosha Harumiya, both located in Shimosuwa. The bus took us to each shrine and we could visit them. And actually, the driver took a load of the tour guide. Well, he was really good at doing that and I learned a lot. I forgot to mention one thing this tour is completely free. And it is said that this grand shrine has divine favor in economic fortune. Like, you'll be lucky with money. <laughs> Don't you want to visit there? Well, actually, I prayed a lot. Maybe too much. <laughs> And there is a big and important festival once in six years at Suwagram Shrine. It is called Onbashira Festival. Well, this festival is known as one of the dangerous festivals in the world. It is described as the Onbashira Festival is basically a landlocked splash mountain for the suicidal. Although it's technically about placing sacred pillars around an ancient Shinto shrine, the festival's true appeal lies in riding multi town trees down steepest hills, knowing full well your bones could wind up crushed into the fine powder, should you fall the wrong way, or the right way, or pretty much any way. What do you think? Well, actually, I've never been at this festival before, and this one will be held in 2016 next time. So, I might go and see the real Onbashiro festival. And I had a lunch at the famous grilled eel restaurant in the area, Furuhata. They are super nice.
I really like grilled eel. Yummy! And I headed to Tateshina Highland in Nagano, where we can enjoy full of nature and of course onsen. And actually there is another Shinyu at the Tateshina Highland. Tateshina Kogen Resort Hotel Shinyu. Well, this Shinyu is the hotel, yet there are onsen baths, traditional Japanese style room, washitsu, and other facilities guests can enjoy. And I will show you more about uh, Tateshina Highlands and of course this Shinyu in the next video. So, what do you think about this video? Well, let me know what you think. Leave a comment below. And if you have questions, of course, please leave a comment below. I'll answer it. Of course, if you are planning to travel to Japan and having problems or questions, please contact me. I'll be your help. And thumbs up if you like this video. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you haven't liked me on my Facebook page, please like my Facebook page too. Okay, thank you for watching and I will see you soon on Experience Japan with Yuka. Bye! Hi, it's Yuka. Well, today I came at the Yasua in Nagano. And I'm gonna stay at here Shinyu, which is a Japanese style ryokan. This time I stayed at Shinyu in Nagano. Well, 